Steve Kress was born in Martinez, California on July 15, 1962. At an early age, Steve had a mechanical mind that, as the years progressed, grew into an ability to fix just about anything. The 70s was a time of growth for Steve. He grew up in the small town of Antioch, located in the heart of California. Steve had ample opportunity to expand his mechanical abilities building go-karts, mini-bikes, and motorcycles that he used to scour the black diamond foothills. He used machines that were loud, fast, and powerful to explore and conquer those hills for years, which fortified his passion for all things mechanical. You could say that Steve was born to ride, and born to build. In 1979, at age 17, Steve became an esteemed member of the United States Navy. His naval career landed him in the UDT SEAL Elite Forces, where he dominated the obstacle courses of several training facilities across the country. He rarely lost, and always performed with the goals of doing better, being stronger, moving faster, and being the best that he could possibly be for the challenge and the camaraderie of his fellow servicemen. Steve carried his passion and work ideals into his mechanical career and graduated from Universal Technical Institute with a doctorate of motors. Upon departure, he leaped into the field of automotive repair, where he earns the nickname Troubleshooter because of his tremendously successful ability to find solutions to challenging automotive problems. In February of 1985, Steve married the love of his life, Christy. They have been happily married now for 28 years. They have raised three wonderful children, now grown into prodigious, productive adults. Steve's oldest son, Keith, passed away in March of 2012. That was the darkest time of life for Steve and Christy. But they continue to let time heal the deep wounds from his loss. They would say their emotional scars are reminders that we all pass through the fires of life. But it is what we do with our experiences that will define us. It's this resolve that drives Steve to be the best that he can be, with the memory of his son Keith harbored in his heart all the while. While Steve has been active in the pile driving industry since the 80s, it was in 1995 that he took a position with American Pile Driving Equipment, Abe as the Western Division Regional Manager. His new role opened up a broad new horizon of opportunity to use the skills and abilities learned over the course of his career to help accelerate Abe to the number one equipment manufacturer and supplier in the United States West Coast. His ability to troubleshoot and think of new ideas that made contractors successful on the job also helped to make Abe the most successful foundation construction equipment manufacturer in the nation. A new era in the pile driving industry was dawning, fueled by Steve's success and his passionate desire to be the best in the business. The year of 2013 brings a new era for Steve personally. He was given the opportunity to take on a new challenge as Vice President of American Pile Driving Equipment, where he will help direct the company's cell branches across the nation. He will be bringing with him over 28 years of personal pile driving experience from his comprehensive understanding of pile driving equipment to his leadership skills as Ape's Western Division Regional Manager for the past 18 years. He is looking forward to supporting the entire Ape family and to help bring the company together to its next level of greatness. Even through the times of tragedy and change, through the adversity of criticism, through advancement of technology, APE will always be the leader in the foundation equipment industry. We are made stronger through strife and struggle, made more loyal to one another through camaraderie, and have built our company on trust in one another. The bond that holds us together through even the most turbulent times that may come our way is friendship. We are all of one accord, and even though the storms may come, the waves may splash high, we are undivided in our unity of strength in one another through time and commitment not only to our company but to one another as individuals. This rule applies from the very least of us to our chairman and CEO Pat Hughes and our president and CFO Dan Collins, the leaders of APE. 
The strength that we of APE bring is a combined experience of hundreds of years of pile driving success from all corners of America and expanding into the rest of the world. Collectively, we have made the foundation industry a better place to work with better tools, sincere camaraderie, and a sense of urgency that brings solutions to everyone from the apprentice pile buck to the advanced engineers, project managers, and superintendents worldwide. No man is an island. No man stands alone. Strength comes in numbers. Success comes through strong industry ties with deep wooded friendships and a sincere camaraderie that stems from the soul of each of us. We here at APE work together to better one another through the common good of the whole. And it is my goal to bring American pile driving equipment to the next level of greatness. With that said, expect greatness to shine in 2013 and the years to come from all of us in American pile driving equipment. Sincerely, Steve Kress.